Welcome to day 27 of your yoga practice. My name is Mary. We can get burdened with too much stuff. So clutter around our houses, maybe too much floating around in our mind. Let's spend our short practice today cleaning house. Let's get started. So come to the front of your mat and we're just going to do some breathing exercises with movement. So it might feel a little repetitive, but just kind of get into the flow of it. So start in Mountain Pose or Tadasana at the front of your mat. And we'll take a breath in through your belly, ribs, all the way up to your chest and let it go. And let's do that one more time. Deep, full breath in from your belly, ribs, chest, and let it go. Now press your feet into the mat. Bring your arms out and up, stretching, and then bring your hands through your heart as you forward fold, bending your knees a lot. Now slowly roll up, chin to chest. And then when you rise up, let your head come straight. Bring your arms up. Breathing in and exhaling and folding. Rolling up as you breathe in. One breath with the full movement. And then dive down, let all the air go. And just get into the flow of your body. Breathing in and out as you lower down. And let's do that a couple more times. Breathing in and letting go. Clearing house, clearing our minds, cleansing our body with our breath and movement. Rising up and diving down. And one more time, rising up, very slowly this time, rising up, chin to chest, and then come back to mountain pose. And just take a moment in mountain pose, feeling the earth beneath you, your feet in the earth, slight bend to your knees, your shoulders down and back. And just pause. Okay, next we're going to come to a seated position. Have, start with both of your legs out in front of you and sit tall. So have a long spine, both of your sitting bones planted firmly in the earth. Bring your right knee to your chest. We're going to be twisting to the right. So place your right hand behind you. Place your left hand on your right knee to start. See if both of your sitting bones are still equally, the weight is equally distributed. So you can stay here, or you can twist a little bit with movement, possibly bringing your left elbow to right knee. So when you're ready, take a full deep breath in, sitting up tall, and then as you exhale, twist to the right. Not over twisting, feeling sensation, and then breathing in, untwisting a little bit, and then exhaling, twisting to the right. Okay, come back to center. Now bring your left shin to your chest. Bring your left hand behind you. Place your right hand on your knee. Find that spot where both of your sitting bones are planted in the ground. And then take a breath in, sit up tall and then exhale as you twist to the left. Slightly untwist a little bit as you breathe in and exhale and twist. Breathing in and out. And then come back to center. We'll do one forward fold with your feet in front of you. So bring your arms up to the air as you inhale. And then hinge and fold at your hips. 
having a straight spine to start and then just letting yourself release. You could have your knees slightly bent. And then when you're ready to take a breath in, sit up and then we're going to go on our backs. So roll onto your back and then bring your knees up, place your hands on your knees. Just roll from side to side a little bit. Now bring your arms out alongside you like airplane arms and we're going to twist back and forth. So bring your knees towards the left as you exhale and then bring your knees up, inhale and exhale to the right. Breath in as you come center, exhaling, moving left. So now move with your own breath and your stopping point. So maybe your stopping point, your knees are just moving towards the ground and not touching the ground. But maybe at some point it feels okay to let your knees go to the earth. So if it feels okay, we'll hold that. Otherwise, just keep moving from side to side. And we'll just stay here for a breath or two. And when you're ready to take a breath in, come back to center and then move to the other side. Steady, even breath. And then as you breathe in, come to center and we'll just rock from side to side again to give our spine a little massage. And then come to a full body stretch. And then to your resting position, which could be Shavasana with your arms out to your sides with your palms up, your legs slightly in a V. Or whatever position you can come to where you can find stillness. So feel yourself settling in. Feel the earth beneath your back, along the backside of your arms and legs. Notice if you have any tension in any part of your body and see if you can let that go using your breath. So bring awareness to the area that's holding tension. Breathe in and then as you exhale, let the tension go. Now bring awareness to things that might be cluttering your life. It could be too much stuff. It could be thoughts that you're holding on to that are no longer serving you. And take a moment as you're resting here to think about things that are holding you down weighting you down? Is there anything that you can donate or get rid of? Is there an area of your house where things tend to accumulate? Maybe there's an area of your mind where thoughts tend to accumulate. And just think about one thing you could do to reduce the clutter, the weight, the burden. Draw awareness to your breath. And when you're ready, take a deep inhale through your belly, expand your ribs all the way up to your chest and exhale, roll on to your right side and take a moment in gratitude thanking yourself for practicing today. And when you're ready, press up to a seated position, draw your hands to your heart. Thank you so much for practicing today. Namaste.